I'm finally back at the allotment after what feels like an absolute age and actually to be honest with you it has been. I haven't been up here in a meaningful way in quite a few months now to be honest and you've noticed by the lack of videos I've noticed by the lack of time spent outdoors with my hands in the dirt and growing things which I've really missed um, but this year is all about uh, work-life balance for me doing things better and so yeah I'm back hello there thanks so much for tuning in so I'm Tim and this is my carbon coach it's a channel all about sustainable living from allotment life and sort of my blunders through figuring out how to become more self-sustainable and grow things for myself through to uh, shop life in my very own little eco shop here in Taunton that I founded almost 18 months ago now so as I just said it's been a little while since we were up here and especially since we were on film and as you can see it's a bit of a mess this noodle stuff down here actually that's nasturtiums I thought it would do it was like out here it was crazy the last time I was up here so I came along chopped it all down um, so actually I'm just gonna dig that in I know we're meant to be doing no dig and stuff like that but to be honest I could do with the exercise and yeah it's just a just a quick fix to be honest we'll get around to no dig uh, in the future <laughs> once everything's sort of sorted out here so I don't really have any uh, preconceived notion of what this video is meant to be I just came up here because finally the weather's okay fingers crossed touch wood etc etc uh, so we're just gonna make the best of it on my on my day off see what I can do see how much shape I can knock back into this to at least sort of feel like I'm semi prepared for, for a new growing season at all we're gonna be doing some weeding some digging you know the usual stuff on this channel that happens there'll be the odd montage of course um, so in the meantime whilst I just sort of quickly have my breakfast and figure some stuff out uh, why don't you uh, give that uh, like button a tap subscribe if you haven't already and yeah we'll get a crack in so what I've decided to do today is just to work through bed by bed through my four main big beds just get them sort of weeded or turned over and topped up with some fresh soil last year towards the end of last year Morrison's had a load of these gigantic coir uh, compost blocks this is massive 75 liters so what I've got is actually a shed full of those because they reduced them down to like one or two quid I think it was so we'll get the wheelbarrow out we will get those sort of soaking and expanding Get it, like I said weeded and dug each bed and then we'll sort of get that topped up with that fresh coir and yeah should instantly make it look a lot better uh, so yeah cue the montage for this bed was this bed done so dug over weeded to a certain extent uh, coiled up and yeah looking looking fresh and ready to go so on this side we've still got the three beds to go these two don't look like they're going to be too bad uh, that end one it's been neglected for a long time really so that might be might be quite bad uh, you only get one montage of video I'm afraid so we're gonna have to do this by um, the magic of, of uh, filmmaking so there we go that is bed number two done so yeah making good progress number three over there is going to be done in three two one that is bed number three done uh, dug over still got some nasturtium sort of stuff dying down in it that would just yeah mulch down quite nicely uh coir put into it still needs an awful lot of compost to put into that bed to to top it up to the to the brim as it were but that will happen as and when I can uh, so uh, final bed number four at the back again that one needs an awful lot of uh, soil putting into it to top it up but yeah at least I can get it weeded so uh, three two one there we go uh, fourth bed done to be honest I think that one was the the hardest it's got all these um, 
the roots from, the, from all the grass uh, from against the edge there, uh, couch grass or whatever it's called. But anyway, job done. I know the middle one there looks a bit messy still, but that is dug and good. So yeah, look at that. What a day's work. I'm well chuffed with that, to be honest. Um, yeah, really, really glad that I have had the time, made the time to come up here and do this. I think I mentioned at the start, who knows, it's been a, been a few hours of work since I recorded the intro. But yeah, definitely trying to work on the old um, work-life balance. And to be honest, I'm really, really happy to be back on YouTube making videos, gardening. It's, yeah, it's just been a real joy this morning and this afternoon. It's like three o'clock or something now anyway. I'm going to leave it there for now this week. Uh, I think that's quite enough work. So I'm just going to have a, have a sit down and a chill, to be honest, on the bench. And yeah, just take it in and just enjoy the peace and quiet up here. There's actually not too many other, other people working on their plots today, which... I thought that there, there might have been, might have bumped into a few more people. Never mind. Anyway, so I will be back next week with another video for you all. And uh, now we're getting into the swing of things. Two weeks in a row, let's make it three. Uh, let's keep this streak going. Streaks, as the, as the youth say. Uh, all that's left for me to do is to say uh, thanks very much for watching. Of course, there's a train just as I'm about to sign off. So where was I? Oh yeah, um, don't forget to subscribe, uh, ring the notification bell if that's your thing, um, slap that like button, leave a comment down below, etc, etc. Take care of yourselves, uh, take care of the planet and each other. Have a fantastic week everyone. Cheers.